Hey guys, Johnny here back with more Call of Duty Mobile. Today, we talk about the upcoming Season 5 update. Yes, Season 5 is around the corner. Did I really say Season 5? Because there's a bit of confusion right now. Is it going to be Season 4 or Season 5? Are we still in Season 3 right now? Because the rank didn't reset, but we got a new battle pass. So we'll talk about it today. And also, not only we're getting one update, we're getting two updates, guys. One next week and one the week after. So in today's video, we'll check out the new features coming to the next update. But also, we'll talk about what's left next week before the update. So if you guys are excited for the upcoming season, make sure you smash the like right now. And let's get into it. All right, so there was a community update once again on Reddit. They try to update the community every week and they did address the recent bans issue. It was a big story last week. We'll talk about it. But first of all, what's left this week before the update? Here's the schedule for next week. First of all, the Call of Duty Warzone cross promotion event is about to end. What's the Warzone event, guys? Check out your events tab and click on Task Force 1 for 1. You can also check the details in the menu. You can have one free soldier skin this week, guys. And there's three days and 21 hours remaining as I'm recording this. You can get a free soldier prize, guys, or gold stealth. I decided to go for prize, and I don't regret my decision, guys. So, yeah, if you didn't do it, do it now. If you don't know what to do, check out my other videos, guys. I posted twice, so check out my channel. Make sure you get everything you need to know to redeem your free soldier skin now the trap master challenge for battle royale if you don't have the new uh class for battle royale trap master is still available until march 25 so make sure you guys go do the task to unlock this because well if you miss your chance you know it's gonna be back later in the credit store but still i'd rather not waste my credits on that and just do the challenges it's not that hard guys it's actually a pretty cool one and pretty quick i love the new class by the way it's a lot of fun uh next up the heavy shot event ending on march 24 so you guys probably have like four days and a half it's a bit of a grind to get the soldier skin but just getting the kn44 is super fast i did post another video about that one guys with some tips if you guys want to get there faster uh, just do the necessary task and it's gonna be much easier now the other game mode snipers only rapid fire and uh, sticks and stone if you guys like a bit of variety it's pretty cool to play other game modes once in a while and then next week update inbound we don't have a specific day for the update i'm guessing next thursday but uh i really don't know and what they said is we're not getting one update we're getting two updates so the update will be in two parts so let's get into it guys now it seems like we will be getting a new game mode or multiple new game modes i know if you guys heard from the the beta players uh it seems like we're getting a 2v2 game mode it will come with the next updates and they didn't say if it's next week or the week after but definitely uh, for early april we'll get everything on top of that we will be getting a brand new season pass or battle pass 13 days left remaining so not on next week's update but the week after is going to be the second part of the update we'll get a new season pass we don't have much leak so far guys we don't know exactly what will be in the season pass but we know that uh, this sunday is going to be the last weekly challenges of this season so make sure you guys don't miss out if you didn't reach rank 50 yet or tier 50 uh go for it guys i don't know if you bought the season pass or not but even if you're free to play uh, the asm 10 brambles is a pretty cool reward also guys if you're free to play you know i have a huge giveaway eight season pass uh march 28th saturday will be the giveaway so make sure you guys check out my video i posted yesterday enter the giveaway all you have to do is subscribe to the channel and leave your info in the comments so i will draw six winners on youtube one winner on twitter and one more winner on the live chat saturday march 28th now on top of a new season we will be getting a new map they said a few weeks ago they want to try to bring a new map every month and that one is from i'm pretty sure black ops 2 guys because i didn't play black ops 3 and i remember that map so i'm pretty sure it was in black ops 2 uh leave a comment below correct me if i'm wrong and i'm pretty sure the name is meltdown so anyways uh this map is coming to call of duty mobile it's a pretty crazy map from what i remember it should be a lot of fun now the new rank season i have so many questions about when is going to be the reset some guys already unlocked their rewards for master 2 they kind of bored right now they want new rewards to unlock 
and it's been confirmed it's gonna be end of march so not next week but the week after i'm guessing when we get the new season pass everything will reset at the same time the clan season reset the rank season reset and the new season pass all at the same time pretty sure now we'll also be getting a new score streak for multiplayer that one i mean probably not a surprise for you but it's another spoiler from the official community update and we used to call it the RCXD, but apparently it's gonna be a shock RC. Um, and yeah, if you guys played the beta, if you've seen some beta gameplay, uh, some of you guys had a chance to play with it already. And you know what I think about these radio controlled score streak? Like when you unlock it, uh, you will be out of play by the time or for the time you're using it. So think of it like the, the Predator missile. You, you use it. And then you're controlling it in a corner and this is something that you use for a while sometimes you run around the map so you're not active when you're using it and it's not my favorite type of, of score streaks usually yes i use predator but i'd rather use like hunter killer drone you just throw it away and then you keep playing you're still in the game so yeah some guys like these some guys don't like these not a big fan honestly but still it should be fun to have some new stuff and i cannot wait to see if it's gonna be a big part of the meta because usually these are pretty cheap and i want you guys to look at the bottom left corner right now i'm gonna make it bigger i want you guys to see this call of duty mobile steel legion season 5 so yes that's what i said season 5 at the start of the video because it wasn't clear a lot of people said guys we're season three and a half right now. Why people talk about season five already? We're just going to season four. Well, apparently we are in season four and this is gonna be season five. Unless it's a mistake, nothing's been officially said about season four or five. The only said this season is disavowed, but it didn't say season four anywhere. So there was confusion. I, it could be the answer guys. And let me know in the comments once again, what you guys think, is it? legit are we going to season five like does it really matter <laughs> if there's a number on the season i really don't care for real i just want the rewards and work on the challenges and stuff all right so new score streak uh new map and new reset and new season pass there's gonna be a lot of stuff coming in the next two weeks it should be really exciting don't forget to enter my giveaway now next topic is the bans they did address the big wave on of unfair bans and how they resolved it so i'm gonna show you the reddit real quick this is the post on the reddit on the official community update they did address the bans and it's been going on for a while we've seen more and more posts of people getting banned but they say i didn't cheat and i got banned but they said sorry we cannot do anything all bans are final we will not review and we're not gonna tell you why you got banned my buddy Gold Lion, I've been playing with him since beta, got banned more than two or three weeks ago, okay? But then last week, a bigger YouTuber called Noah, Noah from YouTube got banned and now they got the attention because there was so many threads on Reddit and they finally realized they had to investigate and something was wrong with the ban or the detection measures. It was very specific, like if you, if you switch device real quick, and if you got reported a few times because you're too good, well, it would trigger a ban and nobody could appeal, appeal their bans. So they investigate and they found the error and they unban like 500 players got banned for that. I know some guys probably quit the game after the ban. Some guys put a lot of money in this game, guys, and there was nothing they could do. So they fixed it. They unban a bunch of players and they said they will give them something, a compensation. They, they don't say what. But they say uh, they will give them something to to apologize. So I cannot wait to see what the gift will be. If you guys uh, have something, just let me know in the comments later. And we're not done, guys. Another thing is coming on the next update. It's another credit shop update. Now, the credit store update was another hot topic last week, guys, when we got the credit shop for two reasons. And like i want to address that once again guys because i'm really sensitive about what's been said in the comments i think we should stay respectful to each other because some comments i've seen they don't make sense like it's not about i understand all opinions and everyone has the right to their opinion but don't call people idiots 
or stupid just because they don't think like you. And I didn't even take a side. I said, about the Royal Crimson, I didn't have it, so I did buy it. I was, like, for me, it was good. I did buy a weapon for 20,000 credits, and I was pretty happy. But I said, think of the other guys that bought it before. Not just because they spent money, but because for them, there's nothing new in the shop once again. They already have it. So they're stuck with like 60, 70,000 credits. They have nothing to do with it. So I would be mad if they put something that I already have, not just because I spent money, because some guys didn't spend that much money and they got lucky. The problem is because you already have it. So you want, it would be nice to have some new stuff in the shop, some stuff that didn't exist or was not in crates before. Like what's the point of just recycling items? Think of it this way. But calling people stupid because they spend money in a mobile game, I mean, a console game, it costs money. A console costs money. If these games are free, people are working to create the games. I know they make tons of money, but still, you need to understand, okay? Some guys like to spend money on that, and it doesn't make them stupid. So, anyways, talking about the credit shop, they also said they want to try to update the shop every month. So I'm expecting something new. We did have the, the zombie stuff. We don't know for how long once again, since they're removing zombies in about less than a week. If you didn't finish farming these, well, you can just finish buying shards. But I would say keep farming until the end, guys, because this is very expensive. I get lots of comments from free to play players. You have no idea how long it is to get 20,000 credits for a free to play player. So 20,000 is going to be 60,000 for the three epic items. And another one here is like 80,000. I don't even have that. So yeah, it is expensive. So you better grind. Some guys are mad also because they grind a lot to get these and now people can just buy it. But it's not as easy as that. Like they say, it takes a while to get 20,000 credits. So anyways, guys, that's pretty much it. Once again, smash the like if you're excited for that big, big update. Cannot wait to see some season pass leaks, guys. Check the channel in the next two weeks. Definitely, we're going to see that. And once again, make sure you enter the giveaway, guys. Subscribe, like, leave your info in the comments from the, the giveaway video. Uh, check out the Twitter. It's right there, JC Gaming on Twitter. And yeah, good luck, everyone. Again, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. I will see you guys in the next one. Take care.